say, you know, people, somebody that grew up believing in Santa Claus, and you're 20 something years old and you still believe in Santa Claus, and then someone tells you Santa Claus is not real, you know, it's like, it's, uh, it, was, it, was, it was like devastating, but I remember looking up at the sky, you know, looking up, and I thought, and I said, I knew it. I knew it. The whole time, I knew it. And, and that was the answer to what, what to, again, what I was looking for was not in my surroundings. It was not where, where I can grasp it. And that's, I knew that that was the beginning of my finding what I was looking for all my life. Okay? So eventually, you know, we, uh, we, we, uh, we, you know, you know, went from, from the No High group to actually going to a Chabad Center. Um, you know, my, my, my in-laws, you know, uh, they, they enjoy the Chabad uh, community. They converted through Chabad. Um, we actually waited, you know, um, we, I, I, I wasn't spectacle, but I, I, I knew that there was a lot for me to learn before I could make a proper decision and for me to, to be, you know, uh, uh, to be effective, you know, as a Jew, you know, and um, so for about two years we went through a conversion process and we converted, you know, and uh, now we're here in Israel. Uh, I have two boys, I have a four and a half year old son, and uh, we have a Sabra, uh, he's, uh, he's about five months old, uh, his name is Ariel Israel, so um, and my older son is named uh, Michal David, so you know, it's, it's, I just, I want to I share that, this with you, uh, there's a lot of details, obviously, we, we made a trip to Israel, and you know, before, uh, you know, we, just so many things that, that really inspired me and that really like connected me to Judaism. Uh, but I just I just want to say that like what, what we have what we have as Jews, uh, not just the fact that you have a community, not just the fact that you have because you know our Chachamim talk about you know if everybody is doing wrong, okay, this is, if everybody is doing wrong, and you know the right way to do to do things halakhically, you know, uh, I think the Rambam talks about this, it says, you know, seclude yourself, even if you have to, even if you end up in a cave somewhere in the wilderness, uh, seclude yourself, which means that Judaism, or as a Jew, we're not dependent on the community, we're not dependent on, you know, it's not, this is not a club, you understand, this is, it's not, this is, this is, you know, this is going back to our forefathers, you know, Abraham, Yitzhak, and Yaakov, People that, that that stood against against the the the, the current uh, situation, you know, in, in Abraham's time, you know, had, you had people sacrificing their children to God. You had, you know, Abraham Ivri, Ivri meaning uh, he was Eber. He was uh, on one side of the of the, the philosophical debate, and you know, the, the whole world at that time was on the other side. So being a Jew doesn't mean you know you're being part of a club and, and you know everything is nice and cute. Uh, it, it it means that you stand for something, okay? And and I know when you're born into it, it's like okay, let me find myself or let me figure this out, uh, you know. And sometimes sometimes we can we can we can find ourselves in a position where where you know just like like myself as a Christian that I try to find. Or try to try to to uh, to to make the best out of out of my surroundings and and found challenges and things like that. I'm telling you, as a Jew, you don't have to look anywhere else. You don't have to go searching and go to uh, you know uh, other religions or other other communities or other. You don't have to do that. You don't you don't you don't have to. Spent time, you know, lost, you know, uh, and I'm telling you that from experience, because I, I did all, of, I was that before, you know, I, I, I eventually, you know, Baruch Hashem, you know, uh, was able to retire about that.